Hello friends, I am Reena Mahajan. Welcome to English Oasis. Today we are going to discuss a very important topic and that is how to get admission in Delhi University. A very great trick that I am going to tell you today. A secret tip and that is, okay wait, <laughs> let me just tell you that the DU says that the uh, recent Delhi University admission notice says that the final admissions will be given based on percentage max score in the board exams plus the entrance test that they call DUCET or CUCET. Common entrance test or Delhi University common entrance test. 50% wages to both of them. And English has to be compulsorily into your best four subjects, right? Matlab, three subjects, kuch bhi ho sakte hain. They can be either physics, chemistry, bio, maths, accounts, economics, or whatever is your stream. But the fourth subject to be included in your percentage is English. Definitely English. Let me take an example and make it very clear to you. Suppose there are two students, student A, student B. Student A scored 99, 99, 100 in three subjects and student B also scored 99, 99 and 100 in these three subjects may it be physics, chemistry, accounts, economics, whatever, maths also. The third thing, the very important thing here is that in English student A scored only 70 marks and student B scored 99 marks and here is the glitch the percentage of student a maybe his marks are the same as student b in all the rest of the three subjects percentage of student a is 92 percent and percentage of student b is 99 percent so who is going to get admission in Delhi University or any of the prestigious universities in the whole uh, world in fact. Especially in India where the criteria is that you have to be one. One English subject has to be included in your percentage. So the secret trip is score the maximum max you can and definitely they can be 100 in your English exam. Work out on the others also, but English is the deciding factor of your percentage. Plus, even in the entrance exams, they are going to have too much of English questions. The basic grammar questions, they can be from anywhere, whatever. So, you need to be working on your English grammar skills also. Plus, the board marks, they count a lot. Right? And I wish that every student should get his dream college no matter what. So for that, I'm going to start up a very wonderful series of YouTube videos. In fact, we are going to have classes also. In case you want to join, that's okay. Otherwise, if you uh, continue with the YouTube channel, the only thing you need to do is to subscribe the channel. Please hit the bell icon so that all the notifications of my recent videos whatever i upload is uh, directly with you and this thing is true with every entrance exam uh, most of the questions would be mcq which are more confusing uh, the entrance exam can be for bba bfa uh, ducet ba honors uh, bms english honors economic honors ba honors multimedia mass communication bsc uh, BSc in physical education, whatever entrance test you always give, well, maybe UPSA also. English is going to be a part of it. And whatever you have learned through my videos will definitely give you all through very good marks in your entrance exams. Wish you all the best luck. Thank you.